Sweet, here we are back again. Another day, another day, another challenge. Um, usually, uh, the first time I press record of the day, it always crashes, but today it didn't, so that's cool. Um, it's a freaking rat right away over this. Some, uh, some of this. My mic's completely obstructing, like, the part at the bottom of the screen where it says E, take, duct tape. So, it's kind of great, I guess. Great. Shut up, Dean. Alright, so there's two exits out of this place. We're gonna go out of this one first. Because I believe this one, one of them, I always get them confused. There's stuff on each balcony though, so. I could get on top of this thing. I also thought that this totally did have one of those hollow tapes here for like the vendor. And I thought it was the weapon mod thing. Oh, yeah, okay, it is. Hologram rifle. Yep, cool. Okay. Now we'll. I don't think there's anything else up here that's relevant. So. Yeah, let's just go back. We'll move on. And we'll exit the other door. You sure came a long way to rub this place. Guess who needs to disappear? So that activate hologram thing that we've been hitting on a few of these now. Um, I'm not sure if we'll have the, or if we'll end up using that as our option, but one of the options to convince Dean to stay on the rooftops um, is that you'll activate the hologram so he'll be more safe that way, so he won't have to deal with the, the people in the villa, these uh, ghost people or whatever. Uh, so yeah, by turning on those holograms, that's one of the ways you can convince him. Uh, otherwise, I think maybe a like there's a couple different speech checks you could take or I don't know but either way we're just exploring here getting everything because that's pretty much the best way to play this DLC I mean at this point that I've had I've already found so many chips we could just run through it a little more because we do have tons of uh, tons of stim packs but eh, it's not that big of a deal. But this is the building that we need to ascend, and at the top of this building is where we'll leave Dean. You're at the Gold Scaler area. Now make him stay. Make him stay. So this is where he has to stay. So this is where I'm supposed to put on. What's that there? Wiring? Looks. So
Oops, I should no. I should have chose the. I'll throw you off the roof thing because I think that's how you get the speech check. Oh yeah, wait, maybe we here. Full of it. So you or maybe here? not. I don't know. What? Okay, cool. So we'll throw your ass off the roof, Dean. Old man. Been around for 300 years. Think I can't snap those legs? They're probably like those shitty pencils you get. Like those kids at school have. You just boom, snap. Two fingers. Um. I guess we've been using this a little bit more often, so. And then I'll drop that, like, one in there just in case, you know? in case it's uh, for a speech check or like a perk, I don't know. Uh, now here's the annoying part again where it's like, oh, geez, what do we choose? There's so many things we could choose because everything's pretty decent. Atomic. This thing's actually a pretty freaking good perk, but radiation just isn't that big of a deal anymore. We could do tag, but once again, I just don't even know. Action girl, maybe? I'm having a really hard time deciding. Yeah, boring. If you're using guns, it's a really good perk. Um, geez, I just looked through all of that and I still don't even really know. Man, I don't even know, dude. I feel like such a dummy right now. I just don't even know what I want. Let me take a look through here quick and see if there's legit anything that I would want. Because then we can just, like, you know, try to increase that skill later on. Or... If it's like it needs is like a one of like a, a strength thing, then we could <clears throat> take intense training. I don't know. I have no clue. Fucking action girl. Jesus Christ. I don't give a shit. Oh. holograms for him even even if we've already convinced him to stay whatever just be a good Samaritan you know it's just it's just a nice thing to do oh yeah there's a thingy over here or did we already come through here no we didn't did we no okay no we didn't um Eyeglasses. Wonder what those look like. Eyeglasses. Oh, that's what we're wearing. I thought we were wearing like tinted reading glasses or something. I thought we were wearing reading glasses, and then I was wondering. Okay, well, that nah, was look super nerdy, big time. Uh, yeah, we'll stick with the eyeglasses. Yeah, we could put this on, hey? <laughs> For the damage resistance. 
You look like a dummy. You need his glasses. Anything here? Is this where I was? I don't even. I don't even know. But it, I obviously didn't pick this. So, oh wait, is this where the bobblehead is? This building? I forget. I keep calling it that, talking about the snow globe. Jeez, man, all these lockpicks here. We got 64 bobby pins so far. Dang. We're generous with them in this DLC. There's like nothing in here. Very hard lock. Nothing great. Look at this. Um, harmonica. I do love the harmonica, but I don't think I have enough room in my inventory for that. Weighs a ton, so we'll be over encumbered. where we came in, right? We didn't look in here. I think this is the exit right here to to where Ooh. right. You can sleep on beds that are indoors. Um The exit we were talking about is like a hole in a wall, and there's a tree blocking our our way. Yeah. I swear maybe the the snow globe was in that last area, but I always forget where they are in these freaking DLCs. The only one I remember is the one in Honest Hearts, because that one's or well, I I completely remember where the one in Lonesome Road is too, but. Um, yeah. Anyways, let's grab this up here. Oh, we got a mod for our hollow rifle. The advanced calibration. Hollow rifle, hollow rifle. Got a good spread. It's got a good spread. Thought I saw something. Um, now we need to go get Christine Daye. Up, Christine. Um, so we'll just uh, pass all these speech checks here. So now, uh, the radios, uh, just like with Dean, how there was more clouds when we were with him, uh, with her we'll have, uh, more radios to go up against, and she can interrupt the frequency for a little while, but, uh, then it's back to just having to run, so. Yeah, more radios in this area, but, uh, pretty much know, uh, remember where all the locations are, because the area we're going to her is an inside place, there obviously is this outside portion as we walk to it, but 
She needs to be inside this building, is what I'm trying to say. The pumping station. It's like, okay, I thought that guy was alive for a sec. The homie over here, he's too, uh, he's going too hard to let that guy even be alive. So yeah, up there is where we need to be. So we'll drop the quick save before we head into the green gas. Switching station. Uh, I think that's where we came from with dog, or is that where we need to be? I don't even know. Um, I think that is where we need to be, but uh, I'm just just getting everything. Sure, if we've already been through here, getting a little uh, lost and confused. All right, I think I think this is where we need to be later. Oh no, wait. No, I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing over here. Let's just head back out over here. Just seeing if there's any uh, Dean stashes over here. But it looks like we got nothing. Our boy Dean, not going hard in the paint. Cool, look how short she is. Stand up straight. I wish you could adjust the height of your character in this game. Okay, so we'll... Uh, well, let's do repair 60 because we have the skill. So, get that XP. I'm not sure if we get the XP from... Uh, the last... The... Like using the electric fuse box that we've already found many of, but whatever. Okay, so we got our first radio. Drop the save outside of the save thing, and boom, there it is. Boom, there it is. And we got another one. Usually for most of these, you're just like looking up. It's always going to be up. This one, I think, yeah. So for this thing right here, um, Essentially, this is our best bet. You hit this pipe, jump over to the staircase, and you already made your way through the thing. Otherwise, you have to go through a little bit of like a tiny maze, and uh, and there's like bear traps and shire down there. So do that, you're good to go. Read all these. Um, automatic rifle. So there is, I think, a lock pick or a key to that. Okay, so we just got the password for a terminal, but we could have hacked it for the XP, whatever. Okay, cool, so now, uh, the room to the west, which is the room over here, should all be cleared up. Yep, look at that. Boom. Beautiful. Now... 
I always forget, but okay, yeah, see that over there? Can't destroy that one. So here's what we're gonna do. We drop the save, we holster our pistol, and we just run. And yeah, here's this. Gotta disarm this. Don't have the time, don't have the time, don't have the time. Whew. Big time close right there. Alright. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna try to... Darn it. Oh, did I get it? <laughs> Feel like, yeah. Um. Okay. Let's just put on this again. And we'll say, Christine, wait here. Because. Ah. There's a good chance. Yeah, okay, we're good. We got it. Barter. Barter. This could be it. Nope. Barter. Nope, that's not it. Barter. Maybe. Shovel. Possibly. Yep. Turn speakers off. Status report. Cool. And we got a Dean's Electronics. So in case your pair wasn't already at a hundred, or you wanted this Merc veteran outfit, um, freaking right there, buddy. Right there, buddy. That's how you do it. That's how you do it, brother. Um, where is it? Where is it, Merc? Was I already on it? I don't know. Uh, let's repair it up with this and see what the see what the info is on that. So damage threshold one, pretty shit. Um, let's go. I'm not sure if there's anything uh, worth it over there for us, but either way, that's how you do it. That's how you do it, up boys. Drop another auto save if I haven't already dropped six, just because uh, if we're able to get that part done. And so, if I remember correctly, or maybe it's right below our feet this time, like over down here to the left. Uh, and I'm being a little... Oh, it's over here to the left, yep. So, we'll pick this, and I believe the terminal in here, which is the terminal we got the password to previously in that locker, will shut the speakers off. Something like that. I think this, like, terminal has all the controls up in it. I don't know if it's this one, but... Okay, poor zero. Not that one, so... Could be this. Yep. Turn speakers off. Sweet. And we go to this terminal. Oh, disengage lock. Drop a save. All right. being a little weary here, making sure that we're not going to step on any mines or some bullshit. Okay, so this is the key to the locker. And I believe, yeah, the locker key, so it explains what's in there. Otherwise, that's it for this one, pretty much. It's freaking wrecked that. So, here we are with Christine. Um...
we'll be all uh we'll be all you know thoughtful and stuff don't worry christine job. we'll get That's through this the gale event. we'll it's get through this up. hun i'm sure you'll find a way to climb up there thirds are gone but might as well up here and oh I'm not looking anymore, I just, it's just, this terminal doesn't matter, so. This terminal doesn't matter yet, I'm like sifting through all this. There's probably only one word it could be right now, like it's probably concerning. But I just don't want to be a loser who gets locked out. Did I already choose conspiracy? Yeah, I did. So it can only be this. Okay. Let's make sure those turrets are deactivated. I gotta make sure, right? Alright. I don't even remember. I feel like there is something down here, like a skill magazine. But if there is, it's probably not even a, really a great one or anything. So... Let's go back up the staircase over yonder, and we'll make our way well and out of here. Whoa! Getting a warning over there on OBS. Warning: High CP, high encoding CPU usage. Consider turning down settings. All right, I'll adjust them afterwards. I'm, I've never gotten that, and these are the same settings I always use, though. So. We'll take a look at what's going on with OBS in a second. No, we got a dead guy. We got a dead guy. Nothing. All right, so let's just exit this place and then uh, I'll stop the recording for some. Like I don't know if it's uh, getting all frozen up in the actual recording, but when I look at OBS, it is getting all frozen up. So. We'll save here and we'll stop it right now.